Hi, so what you're seeing here is my workstation, and from left to right I have a 2K monitor that's 27 inch, a LG 32 inch 4K monitor, and a 1080p laptop. And what I want to show you is the font size relative uh, to each of these monitors. As so I have the same text file opened up on all three screens, and what I want to show you is how many lines of text fits on each one of them in their native resolution. So let me go ahead and uh, zoom in and give you a sense of just how much smaller the fonts are, but also how many uh, lines of text actually fits on each of the three resolutions. So in addition to the number of lines you want to see fitting into each screen, you also want to look at the width of the lines. So for the laptop, I could fit 51 lines, 52 lines, and you could see there um, just to also try to get a sense of the relative size. So I'm trying to stay at a constant distance from the screen. So you could see uh, the empty space that's all on the right. Now I'm going to zoom in here and you can see for the 4K monitor I could fit 115 lines of text. And obviously all of these lines fit in one screen. So you could see all the empty space there on the right. And there is the 50 second line. So you could see it's all the way up in the middle, obviously. Um, but you'll notice that the text itself is about 20% smaller than the laptop. So you might struggle a little bit to see it. I, I would say this is that a 32 inch monitor for a 4K resolution is the minimal monitor size you should get. You probably should get a 34 inch if you can. Now here's the 2K. You can see for the 2K it's not as dramatic. The 2K can fit 72 lines and keep in mind um, it's about 25 percent bigger than a 1080p, so that's the 2K. And just to get a sense of the font size, so once again, I am trying to stay a constant distance away to, to give you a relative look at just how much smaller the 4K lettering is. And so you can see the 2K here, and quickly that of the 4K. Now if if you're pro probably if if you're under 40 your your eyes are not blurry yet in in that sense you you probably can in in that you don't need reading glasses. So you probably can see the 2K fine in its native resolution for the text size. And you know just going back to the laptop 1080p full HD for comparison. Now for some people the font size and the icon size will be a little bit too small so they're going to be using display scaling to zoom the fonts and the icons. So you'll notice how small the icons are right now on the menu. So what I'm going to do is um, also show you the fonts. So you can see the fonts are also very small on this 4K monitor. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to demonstrate display scaling. So I'm just going to right click on the screen and I'm going to select display settings. And when the dialog box comes up for display settings, I'm actually going to choose my monitor. So my 2K mo my 4K monitor here is actually monitor number 2. So I'm actually going to click and choose my monitor number 2. So that's the blue monitor that's highlighted now. And what I'm going to do here is I'm going to switch between the 100, 120, and the recommended 150. And then I'm actually going to zoom out and also show you the icons and menu. So um, first I'm just going to show you the 100, 125, and the 150. And then I'm going to pan out and show you all three of those and back to the 100. So you could see the relative sizes of each one of them after the display adjustments. So here's the display scaling or font scaling. So that's the 150. 
and you can see just by how big the dialog box is and how much bigger the icons are now on the menu option and I went back to the 100 here so I'm gonna flip back and forth one more time so just so you could get a better look here of the display scaling so there's the 125 and the recommended here which is the 150 and you can see how much bigger the menu icons are the menu bar at the bottom of the monitor and now I'm gonna flip back to the native resolution which is the 100 and you could see also just how much smaller the menu bar became so let me just um, give you a sense here of the menu bar and that's the 125 and doing it one more time for the 150 which is the recommended setting for the display scaling and then back to the 100 now this kind of defeats the purpose a little bit of getting the 4k native resolution because you really do want to fit a maximum amount of items in the native resolution so my last demo here is I want to show you the difference between the size of the fonts when I go from the display scaling of 100 to 125 to 150 and then back to 100 so you could see the difference in the font size but as I mentioned it sort of defeats the purpose of getting a 4k monitor if you're going to use display scaling so you might want to opt for a 34 inch monitor instead of a 32 inch monitor or if you really don't use reading glasses and a, a 32 inch monitor might just be enough for a 4k uh, but that's really it I hope this helps and uh, please subscribe and thank you for watching